Let's go over some true and false statements about macromolecules. I'm gonna show you three statements about each. You have to figure out which ones are true and which ones are false. Let's start out looking at the four macromolecules in general. Number one says all four macromolecules have carbon. Number two says all four macromolecules have different monomers. And number three says the four macromolecules are proteins, nucleic acids, water, and carbohydrates. So which of these are true and which of these are false? The first two statements here are true. All four macromolecules have carbon and all four macromolecules have different monomers. The last one here is false because water is not one of the macromolecules. It's much smaller than macromolecules and it's just not a part of this group. All right, now let's do some true and false statements about nucleic acids. Number one says ADP and ATP are examples of nucleic acids. Number two says nucleic acids are composed of monomers called amino acids. And number three says nucleic acids store and transfer genetic information. So again, which of these are true and which of these are false? The first and last are true. ADP and ATP are examples of nucleic acids and they store typically, not all the time, genetic information. However, the monomer of nucleic acids is not amino acids, it's the nucleotide. Next, let's cover some true and false statements about proteins. Number one says there are 20 different types of amino acids. Number two says proteins are the only macromolecule that contain phosphorus. Number three says a majority of your dry mass is made of proteins. So again, which of these are true, which of these are false? The first and last statements are true. There are 20 different types of amino acids, which is the monomer of proteins. And the majority of your dry mass, that's just your mass without water, is made of proteins. However, proteins don't contain phosphorus. It is the nucleic acids that do. Next, let's cover some true and false statements about carbohydrates. Number one says carbohydrates are hydrophobic. Number two says carbohydrates are made out of the monomer sugar. Number three says carbohydrates contain carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen. So which of these three are true and which of these three are false? The last two here are true. The carbohydrate monomer is sugar and carbohydrates contain carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen. However, the first one is not true, it's false, because they're not hydrophobic. That is lipids that are hydrophobic. And lastly, let's do some true and false statements about lipids. All right, let's do some true and false statements about lipids. Number one says lipids contain carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen. Number two says every lipid has the monomer of a fatty acid. And number three says lipids are the only macromolecule not found in humans. So which of these are true, which of these are false? In this one, there are two false statements. You can see here, every lipid has the monomer of a fatty acid. That's not true. Steroids are considered lipids, but they don't contain fatty acids. So there isn't one true monomer of a lipid because there are some exceptions. And the last one here, lipids are the only macromolecule not found in humans. Absolutely not. There are tons of lipids that are found in humans. The only one that is true is that lipids do contain carbon, hydrogen, oxygen, just not in the same ratio as in the carbohydrates.